Ken's hack today I'm going to show you how to use LYC low orbit ion cannon is a DDoS program for Mac well I'm going to use the Mac port of it um, this video has been requested by the YouTube user named ironically hacker <laughs> that's all um, he asked me if, to, if I can make a tutorial about the newer version of the program because apparently the whole program got updated with user interface UI, UI and a new method of how to do it so I looked pro program apparently it did upgrade so it's now version 0.0.3.7 uh, the previous version was 0.0.2.0 well that was the vi uh, version of the, in the video but now we're going to use the 3.7 um, the link will be in the description as always and I will yeah show you how to use the program so a little, little explanation about the whole program um, low orbit ion cannon is a That was not, uh, it's a Java, Java DDoS program. It's uh, so you can use it on Linux and, for example, uh, Mac OS. If you click on this page on the uh, the Canon, it uh, says a little bit about where you can donate to the developers and you can download it. So let's move on on the program. Let's start with one. Uh, select target in the host. You can type in the uh, the user uh, the URL of the website. It's uh, the host name exactly. For example, www.cool.com. Uh, for some reason, if you type here in the URL, it, it won't work exactly. But so in host, you type in the URL of the site and or the IP address which you want. After that, you click on get and it will show you the IP address of a of the the website. Note that will change. For example, if you click Google dot um, Google dot, for example, GP Japan, get something else, and it's just the basic. So we can go out at seven, uh, forty-seven, mean seventy-four, and one hundred twenty-five, and one hundred thirty-six is the basic IP of Google, and that the one hundred three depends on the server sites. For example, use a the uh, United States or some uh, English version dot com, Japanese version GP, um, FR for French, BE for Belgium, RU for Russian, you name it. So we're going to target the English version, the com, it's uh, 103. So after you've done that, you can click on ready, of course, if you want to um, keep it simple. Um, but we're going to change, uh, we're going to explain a little bit of the, about this. Um, at three at attack options just a timeout. Timeout interface uh, interval is um, as to how how long it needs to take before it shuts down. For example 900 9000 seconds it's pretty long. Uh, the HTTP subsite for example the slash if you have any on the site on your shit if you want to hide your stuff. Uh, you can hear Exactly, change the port for example. You have the well, um, and if you change the port for a specific address, for example, a server like Minecraft server, so you type in the, the IP address of the server in this for is this in the host, click and get a little copy in, in here, and you make sure the proxy host, I mean, the host of the port is the port of the server, for example. 25565 whatever 8050 80 is internet but <laughs> something else um after that you can click on the methods for UTP HTTP HTTP and TCP and the threads how many threads you want you also wait for reply or not because if you click on wait for reply it will confirm that it's um that the host exists that the target is uh, exists if you click on none it will just go continue 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 with nothing to do and it'll show you nothing on this thing. So after um, you have the TCP and UDP message, I have no idea what, what it does. Uh, delay, it's um, from delay for how long bef uh, before every everything, every uh, attack, well attack ping. Not exactly ping, uh, but almost the same. For example, one millisecond, two milliseconds to one thousand, one hundred. 
Um, if also if you have a, a proxy socket in your computer, you click on proxy socket, type in the IP address of this of this uh, proxy, and type in the port of the proxy proxy. So after you've done that, everything's set up. You can click on attack, and if you have after you've done click on attack, I'm going to show you how it works. Um, it will show you here how many bits per second it is bytes per second is doing, and it will show you a small um, diagram of the progress what it did at the moment. So as you see in the here I will show you what it's done doing. So as you can see a small diagram and as you can see it's currently busy. So it's about 2.3 sec kilobyte per second is the last one. I'm not going to do it whole video because it's it's not my way um, yeah if you have done that that's basically how you do the program just click on attack and we'll continue 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 until the server got down it's easy to use it for for example on Xbox live IP address for people to connect out people on servers or PlayStation or Minecraft servers or people whatever you want so it's very easy it's great to use um, note it's as all programs um, don't expect it to work in like one minute I mean I get some com uh, comments from people like it doesn't work or it, I use it for one minute it still doesn't work yeah so I say it but you're using your one computer while well, most people use one computer so shitty computer for example a Mac I'm not saying the Mac is a shitty example but I mean they are not powerful enough to knock down a whole server in one minute I mean, if you want to knock down a server, you need at least a few, a decent time and a few people, uh, a few computers. I mean, it's easier to knock a kid off a server or someone else from the server than shut down a server because the server is more, um, needs more resources to shut it down. So, I hope you like this um, little, little video tutorial about the program. If you have any questions or something else request put it down in the description I will always take a look at the description and I will always um, reply to the request I will most of the time I will do it sometimes I won't it depends on what it's requested um, yeah so thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe like and leave a comment in the description and goodbye